Hello, hello. Happy Monday, everybody. I kind of like sports, well, obviously, but especially now we have football on Fridays to close out our week and then some top plays on Monday to get the week started. We are now halfway through our high school football season and the highlights just keep coming. Our first top play comes from down in all gray Sims. The Wolverines were hosting the Alcona Tigers. Mason Van Sickle rolls out, finds Gabe Metzger here, and look at Metzger. The ball's tipped, and he recovers and finds his footing inbounds for the catch before going out. Kept his balance the whole way to, and it looks even better, in slow-mo. What a catch from Metzger, and trust me, more from this game later. Next up, we have the Hillman Tigers. They're hosting the Hale Eagles, and remember the Philly special? Here's the Hillman special. A.J. Jones tosses it to his running back, who then tosses it to Trenton Taratuda, and he sends it back to Jones in the end zone for the tricky Tigers touchdown. The Tigers will go on to win this one, 22 to 20. Back to all gray, and this top play belongs to Alcona and Michael Basner. There were a ton of top plays to choose from in this one, but look at Basner lowering the shoulder and plowing through the defender, and then on the same drive, he is going to bulldoze through a group of Wolverines and then drag one of them with him into the end zone for an Alcona touchdown. And yes, we still have more from this one coming up. Now we have the Atlanta Huskies, and this was before the game got bombarded with rain. TJ Curry is going to hold on to the ball and break free virtually untouched by the Hornet defense, and he's going to run over 60 yards for the Atlanta touchdown. The Huskies would unfortunately lose this matchup against Pelston 56 to 36. Now back over to Augre Sims for our last top play, and this one belongs to the Wolverine Keegan Bender. He takes a short pass in the flat from Van Sickle, and Bender drops a hit, barrels through the defender on his way for a long Wolverine touchdown. He trucked this guy at the 50-yard line and then ran 50 yards for the score. A lot of physical running from these two, but a huge second-half lead led Augre to victory 72-32. to Now, as always, this poll will be posted to our website and our Facebook. And you have until Friday at 4 p.m. to vote for what you think is the top play of the week. And we'll have the winner announced during our 6 and 11 p.m. newscasts on Friday.